Here with UWL head wrestling coach Dave Malachek as we look forward to the 2024 uh, conference championships yep. uh, presented by Culver's this Saturday down at Platteville. Yep. Uh, coach, let's just talk about uh, going into the, before we talk about the extra championships, just talk about where you're at right now with your team. You wrestled last week. You've had a little bit of a break here as yep. you gear up for the conference championship Saturday down, like in, like I said, in Platteville. Yeah, absolutely. And, and Dave, we ended up with a dual win over Platteville and had an opportunity to kind of reevaluate and, and get these guys on the on the right path. They've been on the right path, but just fine tuning things. Uh, you get towards the month of February as we head into March. Just that that many weeks of season left, and and these guys uh, just really getting ready to go. What we call championship season. You got conference championships. Two weeks later, you got regional championships, and two weeks after that, you got NCAA championships. So. Our guys know what time of the year it is. I mean, they're uh, not trying to change a million things, just trying to wrestle in their best position. So I really like where we're at. I mean, obviously we're gonna find out on Saturday and make some adjustments after that and get ready to go for regionals and then nationals. Uh, going for your eighth straight conference title. Okay. Uh, you have a lot uh, of wrestlers with, uh, I think it's 11 guys who have placed at the tournament. Okay. Uh, let's just talk about how that experience will help you on Saturday. Yeah, definitely. These guys know what it's like to be in that conference championship and they know their, you know, their role or the, the things that they need to do for this team. And, and it's all about the team right now. Two guys at each weight class uh, try to do their very best and, and understand that they need to wrestle at a very high level. Some of these guys, uh, maybe they beat throughout the season in a duel or tournament, or maybe they've gotten beat by them. And so I think that's one of the unique things about this conference championship. You're gonna get the best from everybody in all six schools and you know 12 guys at each weight class. They're, they're gonna battle pretty hard. So yeah, a lot of returners, uh, but so do the other teams as well. And uh, I think you just got to put a good day together, round by round with these guys, having both guys at the weight class battling really hard. Uh, let's just go through the weight class. Just start sure. at 125. Let's, let's just go through it. Like I said, you have some returning champions, yeah. but let's just go through the. Yeah, we, we'll have two freshmen at 125 with Quentin Wolbert and Thomas Gear. Um, they've done a really good job, and Thomas is maybe a little more limited in his matches, but uh, Quinn's, you know really done a nice job second semester i mean he hasn't lost since the augsburg duel on january 20th or 21st so he's gone almost a whole month i think he's won 10 or 11 in a row and doing a really good job there hard three three got senior um zach weiler and freshman matt haldeman who are going to do a really good job for us uh battling in there at that weight class 41 you got junior sam lorenz and uh freshman caden charant um who have both have won a ton of matches this year so i, I look forward to that weight class and they've got guys in that weight that have beaten them 49, you'll have the number one seed with um, uh, Zach, <laughs> Zach, Tyler Gable, and uh, along at, uh, along with Josh Turbo, who's going to get a shot here at the conference at 49. 57, you got the returning champ, Nolan Hurdle, uh, and then uh, Cooper Larson's going to get an opportunity. We've had some injuries at 157, and so Coop gets his chance uh, at 157. Uh, 65, Noel Ice Gang, like we talked a little bit about. Um, he's going to be there at 65, along with Tate. Freshman Tate Flaggy, uh, who's had a really good season. I think he leads the team in wins with 25 or 26 wins. Done a really good job. 74, Eddie Symes, uh, freshman, uh, along with Cameron Denny, another freshman at 74. So we got two freshmen there uh, at a tough, tough weight class. Number one ranked guy in the country, number two ranked guy, national finals is in the weight stricker from uh, Eau Claire. So that's going to be really tough. 184, Marcus Orlandoni. He's done a great job as a junior. And then, um, you know, Sam Schwab, he's a sophomore as well. 184, moved up from 174. 197, Ben Kopchinski will be the number one seed. He's had a great season. He's 19-2 and two on the year. Along with freshman Casey Gish. Casey came and won the Pete Wilson Open here a couple weeks ago. Had a great tournament and showed that he belongs with those guys. So they're going to be battling out at 197 at heavyweight. We're only taking one guy, and that's uh, Mike Douglas at heavyweight. Uh, Coach, let's talk about yourself. You've been here a long time here. <laughs> Just uh, experience, as we like to say, right? Yeah, right? But this year's team, like you just mentioned, you've got some young guys and you've got yeah. some veterans on their team. Yeah. Just just how they've mixed and how, how you've seen them develop, too. The first interview I did with you, Dave, this year, you said, man, you got a lot of new guys and freshmen and transfers. And we did. We graduated a lot of amazing men, and uh, these young guys have adapted. And it took us a little while to kind of get going and kind of find out their roles and and to embrace that role. And I think you've seen some of the young guys challenge the older guys. You've seen some freshmen step up. Um, you feel good about the future of the program. Uh, yes, we are a little bit older. I say we, Dave, we are a little <laughs> bit older. And the experience comes into play, but it also, that doesn't mean I'm still not really nervous about the conference championship. I'm not nervous about for our guys, but I feel very confident in them. I, I feel like we did our work in here leading up to this, and then they get to go out and have some fun on Saturday. And there's no pressure on us. It's not about winning a conference championship. It's about can we improve and can we wrestle at our very best? And and I say we, they wrestle at their very best. As coaches, we're going to sit back and enjoy this uh, experience and embrace it 
And uh, that's ha that's taken through experience though too, Dave. I haven't always been like this. And so <laughs> I've actually slept a couple nights this week, so which has been nice. Uh, and just because of the fact I know the guys have worked hard. They're really excited about showcasing UW lacrosse and they're excited about championship season. So that gets me excited. Thanks coach, good luck. Thank you.